Hello guys in today's video we're gonna check out the top 5 most powerful full auto BB guns. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I tried to list them based on their price quality durability and more, if you want to see their price and find out more information about them, you can check out the links in the description below. Ok so let's get started with the video. Hey everyone, Stephanie here from the Air Division here at Sig Sauer. Let's talk about the cane break. Not any cane break, but the 177 caliber air gun cane break. This may look like a firearm because it mimics a firearm. This is a replica in an air gun form, pellets, uh, which is a fantastic training mechanism and an all around just fun plinking rifle. So let's go through some of the features as to why it's so great. Front and rear flip up sights. These are awesome. They are windage and elevation adjustable so that you can use them downrange at different lengths and variations, 50 yards, 30 yards, bring it on into 15 if you're really looking to hone in on that target. These are great for that. Uh, all around and it is a M-lock handguard here up front which is nice because if you have any accessories that you carry on your firearm rifle they will transition to your air gun rifle so that you can practice what you preach and throw it on this as well which is really nice. Moving to the rear it does have a charging handle as well doesn't pull back as far as your rifle, but the point of this charging handle is to actually pierce the CO2 cylinder that is in the back of your rifle, which is your power source. This is a 90 gram CO2 cylinder power source. So you pull that charging handle that one time on a new CO2 cylinder and you are locked and loaded and ready to go. Hey everybody, I'm David for Umarex and I'm out today with as much fun as you can possibly have for under $100. This is the Umarex Legends C96. It is the notorious broom handled Mauser. And, you know, as far as I'm concerned, this may very well be the single most beautiful firearm ever built. When you look at the C96, you'll notice that ergonomics were not paramount in their decision making process. The grip swells out much in the way old revolvers used to. If you think about single action army and the way that grip swells down, the lines are still there, very reminiscent of that. But that puts all of the weight above your hand. Ergonomically, this gun kind of suffers from some of its modern designs. But for a gun from the late 1890s, it was revolutionary. Now, this gun is, is often associated with World War I, but by that point in time, it had been in existence for close to 20 years. The C96, the old broom handle, many of the early C96 guns loaded from the top. They had a little opening here when you pull back, open up, feed rounds straight down in. Later models did have detachable magazines, and Umarex has taken advantage of that with this magazine here. The magazine holds the CO2 capsule, it also holds the BBs, which we'll notice here on the front is a little slide, slides all the way down, load the BBs in, they're there, the CO2 cartridge feeds in from the bottom and screws in tight with this nice bolt. There's a tremendous amount of weight to this, it feels very similar to a fully loaded magazine. You give it a slight pop, it sticks in nicely. Now on the other side of the gun, your controls, this is predominantly a right-handed gun. So what you have is a safety, oh, we're not cocked right now so the safety won't roll up. And you have a button that switches you between single shot fire and full auto. And in full auto, she really flies. Hey everyone, Stephanie here from Sig Sauer Airgun Team. Let's talk about our ASP MPX MRD. What does all that mean? It is our Advanced Sport Pellet MPX Mini Red Dot Optic. Uh, we also have this model in a base model that comes with front flip up sights. Comes in two different colors. It is a fantastic training mechanism. This mimics the weight and dimension of our real MPX rifles. Um, great for downrange, backyard, 
pop that red dot on and you will be on site to take out any squirrel or rodent that happens to be in your vegetable garden. It's also great on paper targets or any of our six hour air gun targets that we have available. Um, going to the rear here, some features, threaded uh, CO2 entry, 90 or 88 gram that gets then shielded by your buttstock. Ambi safety lever for those righties and lefties just like me. One of the coolest features on this rifle happens to be our patent 30 round belt fed magazine. This is a rapid fire belt fed magazine, which means that you get 30 rounds down range in 3.5 seconds if you have a fast enough trigger. So keep practicing. Along with that, moving forward, charging handle also is a great muscle memory feature. It does pull back just like your real range gun, giving you, like I said, that muscle memory. It also pierces the CO2 within your buttstock. Um, it has universal side Picatinny reels to add any accessory you want, flashlight, um, laser, whatever you feel fit. Um, and the MRD does come with front and rear flip sights as well. You've waited your whole life for something this cool to hit the air gun market. And the wait is over. Homerax Air Guns is proud to introduce its replica full auto M1A1 to the world. This legend earned its reputation on the streets of Prohibition era America, in the hands of US servicemen during World War II, and in the cinematic representations of both those eras of U.S. history. The M1A1 was the open-bolt lead flinger that had classy, Art Deco-inspired good looks. Now you can fling steel BBs in your backyard in homage to the cinematic or historical inspiration of your choice. The full-auto M1A1 represents yet another instant success in the Full Legends line of historical replicas.